So Barney, what attracts you to a music magazine? Um, first off, the cover would have to be extremely aesthetically pleasing, because I feel um, the first thing you see when looking at a magazine on a stand with news agents or something like that would be the cover. So it needs to have quite expressive covers, it needs to be clear, not too busy, though it also needs to look professional, so if you have vibrant colours, not too much or anything like that. And if it's internet based, the quality of the website needs to be very good and look very professional. Okay, good answer. Uh, what would you spend roughly on a weekly or a monthly magazine? I'd say weekly I would spend about five pounds, um, and monthly I suppose fifteen to twenty pounds. Okay. Uh, what things would you expect in a music magazine? Um, I'd definitely expect tour dates. That'd be one of the most important ones. Or if an artist has a tour coming up, I'd expect interviews with the high-profile artists that uh, are within the genre of that magazine. Um, I would definitely want occasionally maybe one or two pull out posters, but not too many. Maybe it was memorabilia or something like that, a special occasion or something like that. Um, uh, probably details about new albums or anything like that. Um, like recently, there have been quite a lot of albums coming out now in December, which I wouldn't have known about if it wasn't for music magazines and articles. Okay. Um, what sort of colours would you expect in a rap magazine? Quite. Depends. If it's like old school rap, I'd expect black and white, maybe a bit of red, maybe a bit of muted yellow. Though if it's modern rap, where it's got a bit of um, jazz in it, it's a bit more R&B or hip hop or something like that, then I would expect maybe blue, white, very crisp, clear colours, loud artwork, very loud, um, just very vibrant. Okay. Very vibrant. Okay. What sort of artists do you? Uh... Would you expect to see in some sort of rap magazine? Um, J. Cole, Lily Archie, Lil Wayne, Drake, Childish Gambino, um, Bryson Tiller, Yeezy, uh, Kanye West, um, Jay-Z, uh, if he were to ever release another album again, I think he's retired now, but if he were to release another one. Mm -hmm. um, if you're going more into the grime side of rap, then Skepta, Bugsy Malone, um, Boy Better Know, that, those sort of artists. Okay. Um, what sort of clothing would you like to see um, any of the people wear in the magazine? Well, it really depends on the artist, because Childish Gambino is quite an expressive artist, so he often wears Hawaiian shirts, same with Tyler the Creator actually, he's one of the most expressive rappers I know, and he will wear leopard print everything, or luminous pink or luminous green, whereas Drake's a lot more of an understated artist, he sticks to the mainstream style of clothing, he'll wear like fur jackets, or fur on the inside, leather on the outside, or just regular jeans or something like that. So it really depends on the artist. Okay, and uh, finally, would you like to see any album reviews? Um, anything really to do with the album that an artist has released? I would like to see a couple of album reviews. I wouldn't like too many because I feel that would influence my decision on the artist. So if I saw an album review in the actual um, magazine, then that may influence how I... Well, if I saw it before I'd actually listened to the album, then I feel that would affect how I viewed the album when I was listening to it. And I feel that would make the experience a bit worse for me. Okay. Well, thank you very much, Barney. Thanks very much.